she told us to give this to you. Ooh. Your classmates, you've been asleep since the first five minutes of class, and class been over two hours ago. Sorry, Miss Fuller. I don't want you getting kicked out of class, Trey, but I can't allow you to sleep while everyone else is paying attention. I understand, Miss Fuller. Did, did we have a test today? You mean that paper on your desk with all that slob on it? So that mean I got ill? Yes, you should have thought about that before you went to sleep in my class. Miss Fuller, I'm sorry. This, Miss Fuller, I really can't afford another elf. Now I understand that, but I need you to understand that you need to be accountable for the choices you make. You're right, man. I'm sorry. Mr. Green. Well, we have 30 minutes to complete that test. It's full of, I appreciate you. I hope you want for real, big time. Just pass the test and get some sleep. Whatever's keeping you up at night, just let go and let God. There is nothing too big for God. Yes, ma'am, but I've been going through a lot. You don't even know the have, Miss Fuller, but I really appreciate it. Don't give up, Trey. When you have a calling on your life, that's when the hardest tests come. We all have our demons to battle. Just keep fighting. Yes, ma'am. You oh, now have 27 minutes left to take your test. Oh, okay. I'm getting to it. <laughs> How you doing, sir? How you doing, sir? This lady came by. Came by my house first. I guess she knocked on the wrong door. So she summoned over here and I to run you this package. Wait, lady. On the chair, long gray hair, a long black dress. Nice looking lady. For me? This is what lady, sir? What lady? Mr. Allen? What lady, Mr. Allen? Mr. Allen?
kill. Fast to get this to you. Fast to get this to you. Seriously, bro. You hear me? Stop playing with me about that. You know what I'm saying? Because education is a privilege. So don't be too much, you know what I'm saying, like questioning me like, oh, I've been to all my class. You see, what I'm, you see what I'm doing, bro? Getting it, putting it up here, man. Knowledge is power. So, you've been talking about all these girls you're going to get on when got to school. How many, how many numbers you done got? Oh, come on, bro. Now you know how your boy get down. Two some three some four some five some six some whatever. Stop lying. Quit. I ain't stopped since I got here every night. Some bad, blazing and Asian. Be honest, I'm on lunch break right now. I got 15 minutes left. I'm on lunch break. It's two in my house waiting on me right now. Bro, you captain fool. Stop playing fool. <laughs> no. The question is, little boy, have you got on any girls yet? It is this one girl though, fool. I don't know. She's special. Special? Here you come trying to fall in love. She got my head in the bind. I don't know why. But I tried to run up on it at the library. It was closed, she was standing there, so I was trying to ask what her name was. She was playing tough. So I asked her, did she need a ride? Cause it was raining, she still ain't say nothing. 
So you know me. I just like, straight up, trying to get your feet rubbed, but nah. She looked at me crazy. So I was like, I'm finna try this last option. I pulled up on her in a whip. She was still private. She walked in the rain, man. It's crazy. I'm saying to myself, you know, I'ma see on campus and I'ma get on it. 